everyone so today I am going to do my May favorites with you I realized I haven't done a favorites video ever since I started my YouTube channel and that's just because I never had enough products to show you I just had two three products I didn't feel that it's worthy enough to actually make a video out of those two to three products but since in the month of May I have quite a lot of products to show you so I thought I'll inaugurate my favorites video by doing this video so I'll just start showing you quickly the products that I have to show you I have a few beauty and makeup products combined this time so let's begin so I'll start with the beauty favorites first uh, my first beauty favorite is the parachute summer refresh double sunscreens cool mint extracts and coconut milk body lotion I absolutely am addicted to this as you can see I have picked up the biggest bottle available in the market uh, but this one is just so amazing it is summers it's extremely hot I mean hotness is at the peak in Mumbai it is extremely hot and it is very 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 humid and you know we don't want anything on our skin to make us greasy balls so that is the reason I picked up the summer refresh body lotion it is very moisturizing to the skin it provides ample amount of um, nourishment and moisture but it doesn't leave your skin greasy and oily and you uh, have a very very little amount of fragrance like lingering fla fra fla fla lingering fragrance on your body and that stays for about two to three hours four hours you can barely even smell it actually if you put your hand very close to your nose and actually try to <sighs> okay that was the flight and I am okay so I had to edit that part because I couldn't compete with the plane so um, you can actually uh, smell uh, this moisturizer if you keep your hands close to your nose and then try to smell it you can actually smell it but it's very uh, like very mild fragrance but when you initially apply the fragrance is quite high and you literally I mean it feels so good I feel like I'm standing amidst fresh green grass and greenery all around that is the magic of this moisturizing lotion and it is absolutely gorgeous and then my next skincare product is Ole Total Effects 7 in 1 day cream that looks like this and this day cream is very again it is moisturizing but it is not overly sticky or overly greasy product on your skin and I actually have one more skincare product to show you but I kind of got over with it and I threw away the bottle because I at that point did not know that I will be actually doing a favorites video but that one is the Pond's Gold Radiance Anti-Aging Serum serums are liquid based and they are like water based so they get absorbed into the skin really fast and they do provide a concentrated amount of nourishment but they don't leave your skin dry I mean greasy and oily so that gold radiant serum was what I used to absolutely love and I just got over with it and I threw away the bottle um, and then I went to the only total effects 7 in 1 day cream I absolutely love this um, and this is the only cream that I apply on my face after I take my shower and then my third beauty favorite is the Nivea lip butter in the shade raspberry rose and I know this is a lip butter and it is probably the most ideal for uh, wearing in the winter season but my lips are very dry all throughout the year irrespective of the season we are in so I absolutely need nourishment for my lips and I feel that this moisturizes and nourishes the lips it I just apply it overnight like for the night before I go to bed and then when I get up in the morning my lips are actually very very moisturized unlike some days when I forget to apply this and then I get up in the morning and I have all chappy lips so this one is an amazing product and probably this has been my favorite um, ever since it has been launched and I haven't stopped using it since then um, I have used a lot of it actually I don't know if you can actually see but I have used quite a lot of this product and finally my last skincare product is a toner and this one is the biotic bio cucumber pore tightening um, toner this toner is really good because it is for pore tightening and it is for normal to oily skin and if you have seen my videos 
you know that I have a combination to an oily skin especially my face my body skin is not that oily but my face skin is quite oily and this one is for a normal to combination sorry normal to oily skin and it actually helps to remove the dirt and gunk and makeup and everything um, this is what I have been using I think for over a year now I have been using this product and it is just gorgeous um, it also helps to keep your skin fresh so if you are on the go you just need a little bit of this toner put it on the cotton and dab it with your uh, fingers sorry about my bad nails I just I just wanted to do this favorites video first before you know I deck myself up completely uh, because I thought it would be too late to put on this video later on so that just I have like really bad nails so uh, yeah, the Bio Cucumber uh, Toner, this is my favorite and I do recommend it for you if you have an oily skin. Uh, this one is amazing. Okay, so now let's move on to makeup items and I'll start again with the face products first. So the first product that I am using on my face, in fact I use, uh, I have been using all of the summers is the uh, BB cream or CC cream but in particularly in the month of May I have been using the Boshua 123 perfect CC cream this is how it looks and it is basically a three-in-one color corrector it doesn't provide ample amount of coverage but what it does is it because it has color um, things theme in it like it has apricot for anti fatigue green color for anti redness and white color for anti dark spots so this is really good if you have a lot of redness and spot marks on your face moving over to blushes I have two blushes that I have used to maximum times in this month and the first one is max ginger leaf which is perfect for like summer season it is like a bronzing blush I have it on today as well it's amazing blush and I have loved to wear this blush throughout this month and then my next blush that I have chosen to wear is the Maybelline cheeky glow blush in the shade peachy sweetie which is a lighter pink version like like lighter version of fresh coral but fresh coral will also do the same will look the same as uh, peachy sweetie will so yes these are the two blushes that I have been using in, in the month of May for eyeliners I have mostly stuck to the conventional blacks and uh, in color variants I have used turquoise one couple of times and it is really good for the summers it's a very bright poppy color but the one that I have used maximum is the black may absolute silk liner in the shade earth line and this one is basically a brown liner and finally coming over to lip products I have been loving the Maybelline lip polishes throughout the month of May I have worn like a variety of shades of these um, this one is glam 13 this one is sorry this one is glam 9 this one is glam 9 which is basically a pinky color this one is glam 9 which I have been uh, loving in the month of May and then I have also been wearing pop 5 which is a lighter version of glam 9 this one is pop 5 and then this one is glam 9 so I have been using these to go for more nude lips um, uh, you know uh, just to avoid a lot of makeup and you know to look more natural if I am ever going for a nude lipstick that's what I choose and I also have this peachy one this is called um, glam 13 and I have worn this in my turquoise video also that is how glam 13 is this one right here is glam 13 so these are the lipsticks that I have worn. So that was my May favorites video girls. I hope you have all liked it. I'm not very sure if I will be doing a favorites video every month. Like I said at the beginning of the video. I don't have so many products each month to make a video out of it. But if I do, I will definitely make a point to make a favorites video for you all. So with that, I will see you soon in my next video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.